Good day once again. Welcome to today's class on ratios and proportions. So we want to see how to solve this problem we have on ratios and proportions. The ages of A and B are in the ratio of 3 to 5. Four years later, the sum of their ages is 48. Find their present ages. Okay. Now, what you do is you set let their present ages, let the present ages be what? A and what? B. Let their present ages be A and B. Then, what is the total ratio? Total ratio is equal to 3 plus 5 equal to 8. Okay? Then, what is their total present age? Total present age is equal to x. H of A, A H, A present H, A present H is equal to what is ratio? 3 all over the total, total ratio 8 times what? X. B present H is equal to 5 over 8 times what? X. So we have known their present ages now. They say four years later, the sum of their ages is. So, A, A at four years later, at four years later is equal to 3 over 8x plus 1. Four, like four years later. B H at four years later is equal to five X over eight plus four. Okay? So they say four years later the sum of their ages is forty eight. We add since the sum means the result after addition we we'll add this. We say 3x over 8 plus 4 plus 5x over 8 plus 4 equal to 48. Okay? So, that means what we will be having should be what? We now say this plus this 8. 8 go to the last side. It will give us 48 minus 8. That is 40. This plus is 8. Go to the other side, become minus 8. So we'll be having it for 8 minus 8 is 40. We'll be having 3x over 8 plus 5x over 8 equals to 40. Therefore, their LCM is what? 8. 8 by 8, 1, 1 times is 3x. 8 by the 1, 1 times is uh, 5x equals to 1 divided 8, 8, 8 times is 320. Therefore, cancel your LCM because you look for LCM of everything, both the left hand side and the right hand side. That is the reason why you are canceling the LCM. So, in answer, it implies this plus this 8x equal to 320. x equal to 320 over 8, 40. That is the word, total present age. So how do we get it here now? 3 over 8 times 40. 8 here 1, 8 here 5. 5 times 3. We have it to be 15. 
So a present age is 15. A is equal to 15 years. Yes. Okay, they didn't put units here. You leave it. But if they put years, you put years. Then this one will become 5 over 8 times what? 40. 5 times 5, 25. B will be equal to 25. Remember, if they did not put years, then if they put years, like now, if they put years here, it means that I will put years, I will put years. Very important. But if they didn't put units, don't put units, that is just it. Okay? So, they did not put units, I will leave you without putting units. Okay? So that is just it.